Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to integrate Airtable with Jira Cloud. This integration can help you streamline your project management by keeping all of your data in one place. So let's start. First, you need to have an Airtable account and a Jira Cloud account. Once you have those set up, go to your Airtable base and click on your profile icon at the top right corner of the page. In this menu, click on Integrations, then connect new account. Here, you can see several applications that you can integrate with Airtable. Look for Jira Cloud and click on it. In this window, you simply need to allow Airtable to access your Atlassian account by clicking this Accept button below. After that, your Airtable account will now be integrated with Jira Cloud. Another way of doing this integration is by using Zapier. Go to zapier.com and log into your account. If you don't have an account yet, you can create one for free. Once you log in, click on this Create Zap button in the top left corner of the screen. Here, first change the name of the Zap. I'll name it Airtable with Jira Cloud. Next, search for Airtable as your trigger app and select the trigger that you want to use. For example, you can choose New Record. This means that every time a new record is added to the table, it will trigger the integration. After that, click on Continue. Here, connect your Airtable account and select the base and table that you want to use. Then click on Continue. After that, test your trigger to confirm that the right account is connected and that your trigger is set up correctly. Once the record was found, click on Continue to proceed. Now, let's move on to Jira Cloud. Search for Jira Software Cloud and select the action that you want to use. For example, you can choose Create Issue. This means that every time a new record is created in Airtable, Zapier will automatically create a new issue in Jira Cloud. After that, click on Continue. Here, you'll need to connect your Jira Cloud account to Zapier as well. Once you've connected your Jira Cloud account, Zapier will ask you to set up the action. Simply, click on these fields and select the appropriate data from Airtable. Once you're done, Test the Zap to make sure it is working properly. If it is, you can now publish the Zap and turn it on, and then start automating your workflow. So that's it. If you wanted to know how to integrate Airtable with Jira Cloud, that is the easiest way I know how. I hope you find this video helpful, and if you do, kindly give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much, and see you on the next video.